it is February and February for some people, a lot of people, is the month of love. Whether you have a lady friend you want to impress with your English skills this year, here are three of my pet peeves and general no-nos to flirting in English. Number one, the overuse of adjectives and compliments. You have really pretty eyes, by the way. Hey, beautiful. Nice smile. These general comments are nice. It's nice to say someone has nice eyes or a nice smile, but if you don't really know them and you're trying to impress them, it comes across as a little creepy. I'm not saying don't compliment someone, especially if you're already together. They would like to hear that you think their eyes are beautiful or that they have a nice smile. But when you make initial contact with a girl, it comes across as a little insincere. Number two is chat up lines. Did it hurt when you fell from heaven? Do you know what um, this uh, shirt is made of? Girlfriend material. Oh, I seem to have lost my phone number. Can I have yours? Is your name Google? Because I think you've got everything I've been searching for. Only the funniest of men can pull off using a chat up line without taking it seriously and they might be able to make a girl laugh. Mostly, they just make us cringe. So if anyone tries to teach you English chat up lines, tell them you've got better game than that. The third pet peeve in dating is something that you probably have an advantage on over your native speaking competitors. That is the use of bad grammar. I find that native speakers are worse at making grammar mistakes than people who know English as a second language. How is you? What's you up to? We should date in it. No. No. If a woman gets a message on a dating site from like a 30 year old man using this kind of talk, it's an instant turn off. I do believe most girls are still impressed by full sentences when you're first getting to know someone because if you haven't if they haven't heard you speak yet, they don't know if you seriously speak like that. And in their head, when they read the messages, that's how you will sound. That's it. In the dating world, those are my three pet peeves. Overusing complimentary adjectives, cheesy chat up lines, and bad grammar. So what should you write if you're texting a girl or using a dating service? Just be sincere. Ask something you really want to know about them. If you are just looking for a hookup, mm, good luck with that. I can't help you that. <laughs> but asking something sincere about them and, and then being able to give them a compliment on their personality is much better and comes across as a lot less sneaky or seedy than hitting them straight with the compliments and chat up lines. Happy dating! <laughs> I hope you find that useful. I do share one minute bite-sized English tips on Instagram as well at Charlie's English Channel. And if you could subscribe and give me a thumbs up, it would be much appreciated. I will be sharing a new tip along the theme of love next week. See you. Yeah. I hope you find that found. Why can't I speak today? <laughs>